Hello everyone, hope you're doing well. Uh, this video is for you if you're using your Power uh, PSU, server PSU for from your GPU mining uh, or other miners, um, let's say the Acta miner, and to do mining on KS0. So in previous videos I had uh, set up my 12 volt system simply buying on Amazon these adapters XT60 to a five and a half millimeters connector that goes directly to uh, KS0 and that's designed for 10 amp rating which is a higher uh, amperage rating because we're using 12 volt system. However, this is not gonna work if we go in uh, to update our firmware to 160 giga hash because we're gonna be pulling 115 amp, uh, 115 watts. That's about uh, nine and a half, almost 10 amp of our server PSU. And this connector, it's gonna pretty much not gonna work. Uh, although it will work because it's designed for 10 amp, but it's going to be on that maximum capacity plus something in KS0 that shuts the uh, system and it just restarts the miner if you try to use a 12 volt. I was trying to update six of my miners and only one actually worked on 12 volt system. It's probably using a little less power. That's why it was able to uh, uh, actually upgrade firmware all five of them were restarting and not working on 12 volt system so if you're using a 12 volt power psu for ks0 this video may help you again uh, to connect 19 volt uh, step up converter instead of buying your uh, bunch of the especially if you're mining with multiple ks0 like i have six of them uh, i wouldn't want to buy six of the psu a laptop PSU that is 200 watts or 180 watts. Instead, I'm, I'll be just, I purchased three of these 380 watts. They're about $44. And I'll, I'll share the link down below for these connectors and the uh, uh, step up voltage converter. So we're gonna be using 12 volt system and our input we're gonna connect here. So I already pre-made this Basically, all I did the XT6, XT60 connector that's actually rated for 60 amp, so it's pretty safe to use. Um, and I already connected here to negative, to the black, positive, to the red. So we have the input here, our mail, and there is adapters like this sold on Amazon. The reason I'm gonna use that is because I want to use two of my. Uh, connectors to spread out um, the voltage between two of them okay so I already have pre-made two connectors with the females right so I'm gonna connect one here and I turn off power here and then the second one over here and now we have two parallel connectors that just gonna go into the input of our uh, step up converter, right? So we on the input side, make sure you're going to 12 volt input system from your 12 volt PSU. On the other side, you will receive 19 volt output. So likewise, we're gonna use also the uh, splitter to two devices. And this way we can connect safely two of our KS0 miners with the two of these cables just like that. And it's ready to connect to 19 volt system. So I'm gonna quickly show you that it's a stable 19 volt output with my uh, power um, tester. So this tester is capable to test up to uh, 200 watts, I believe, uh, or 300 watts, but I think it's 185 max setup. So I'm gonna run at nine amp. Uh, so we're gonna turn the power on so you could guys see we are at 19 volt stable, 19.2, right? And I'm gonna turn and load it to 170 watts, nine amp, and we are running at 19 volts, 18.9. So pretty stable uh, voltage there, okay? So we are 
uh, we can connect basically two miners to this system, not to overload. It will be running at 60% uh, load. So, and you probably can connect up to 8K0 just to one server PSU, 1200 watts on 200 volt uh, system. So there is no overheating anywhere on these wires. Uh, I've been mining on this already for four days on these converters, no issues. Uh, However, I have upgraded all six of them to 19 volt system, but still cannot upgrade firmware on two of the miners. There is something else just besides the voltage. Uh, so I was able to put four of them, 260 giga hash, and I had to step down to on two of them because they were starting and one of them mining, but it's actually dropping the uh, to 80 giga hash. So, there's an issue maybe with overheating uh, uh, my KS0 or something like that. So I, I hope that helps for you to make that uh, little conversion and get your KS0 at the 160 giga hash uh, easily just by simply using one of those laying around uh, PSE cable, splice it, connect it, and it's ready to go. Now, your power, I want to show you real quick on the full load. So we're going to load again. Forget to show you guys just so you know on the output here at 19 volts, right? So if we load it to 170 watts here, one more time, I want to show you. So it's 170 watts on 110 volt. We actually pulling off the wall 197 watts. So it's about 20 six watts uh, we're losing efficiency on both of these uh, devices however on the 100 240 volts system it's a little bit better at performance so i do recommend using 240 volts on this system and just to get better wattage because you need 1200 watts uh, and you can connect probably safely up to eight devices all right, I hope it helps you on that. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.